this morning. And I think some folks this morning, Ben and Julia, are going to see a little snow just to the west. But just a few of you, probably not here in Indianapolis. I do want to begin, though, showing you radar. So let's show you the satellite imagery. Uh, this is a look at downtown Indy. Here we go. We're clear, basically, here. Um, but just off to the west now, here's Crawfordsville. Here's Covington, Petersburg. So a little bit of very light snow is pushing in there. This is all part of a larger band of snow that is moving from basically north of Mount Vernon over towards Springfield, Illinois. This is all light, but it's holding together. I thought, honestly, that this would fall apart by now, and it has not. So let's focus on the cold, and it is cold. 11 degrees officially here. Our wind chill now is at 3 degrees, so it's a cold one, and we're going to have some slick roads with those chilly temperatures. In fact, I'd say really watch out in some of our rural and outlying areas where probably all of this stuff refroze. It will be freezing literally later today with a high of 32. And I think we're going to see quite a bit of sunshine today. But man, oh man, six degrees in Marion and Kokomo Crawfordsville, you're only at three degrees with a little snow knocking on your door. Uh, wind chills are not that bad. It's, it's cold outside, but not that bad because we don't have much wind. The exception to that is Kokomo where it feels like six below. But right now we're running 11 degrees colder than yesterday at this time. Rensselaer's 18, but I think we'll take the trade off, won't we? A lot of you have been wondering, uh, because we've gotten here in the Weather Center, a lot of emails and texts about this winter storm that will affect northern Indiana. This is the very latest now. A winter storm watch, Plymouth over to Warsaw until midnight Saturday. But also in that time period, a winter storm warning. That's bad when you get that along South Bend where they typically get a lot of snow. From Goshen over towards South Bend, the whole Chicagoland area is under that winter storm warning. Make that uh, in your, as part of your plans if you're headed north to avoid that area. I'll show you why in a minute. 32 is going to be our high today. And the snow potential looks like this. This is going through Friday, Saturday into Sunday. How about this? Fort Wayne, 9 inches. South Bend, 10 inches inches of snow, Chicago 8 inches, and possibly isolated spots of a foot or more. Here we're looking at about an inch of snow on Sunday, but a little freezing rain and drizzle leading up to that. Here's a look at today. Uh, again, a lot of sunshine out there. And then, as promised, that snow starts tomorrow on Friday for points north of Indy. Lafayette, Kokomo, Marion, you get snow. And then this band basically moves to the north Friday into Friday night. That's when the lion's share of this snow will uh, affect, really, uh, the Chicago area and then over towards South Bend and Fort Wayne. Now, on Saturday, we could get a little bit of mist, freezing rain, and rain. I think more than what this shows. Uh, but Sunday, then, in the morning, we get more snow, another chance for snow. As this band moves from Indianapolis to Kokomo to Peru, we're looking at maybe an inch or so during that time period. 32 today. Cloudy here, but snow to our north tomorrow at 44. Saturday, 38 with a little wintry mix. Sunday, a chance for snow and 30. And the day we're looking forward to is Tuesday of next week. Uh, Julia and Ben, when we get a high of 48 by then.